Hey everyone, it's Phil here and you're watching STV Sydney Trains Vlogs. I don't know if you guys remember, but about a week or two ago, I uploaded a Wonderbind video and mentioned that I was helping uh, some UTS students with something. Um, well, what you guys are about to see is what I was helping them with. They were doing like a, an assignment, a documentary, and the students were kind enough to let me upload that. So yeah, thanks for watching and enjoy. And also hit that subscribe button as well if you haven't already. Cheers. Get back, yeah, get right back. Get right back. Welcome to Wonderbine. This is what happens here. From what I heard from the people who live here, there were people, it's a gory story, does that matter? Yay, murder! <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, there was a couple camping near this rock here and um, they had a bit of an argument. The female got a bit too pissed off with her partner and stabbed him to death and apparently dumped his body under the rock there and left. Yeah, I see your face. <laughs> so, yeah, every year that people here on that date put, like, tie or however they do it, um, some flowers to the rock here. Uh, my name's Phil, and, um, well, I'm a gardener, but also a train spotter. So basically I run a YouTube channel, Sydney Trains Vlogs. I go around to many different stations and just film trains and whatever else comes through. And yeah, that's it really, it's so simple. It's simple, yeah. I just like coming here because it's peaceful. Um, there's not too much risk of people getting in the way of filming and things like that and trouble and you know, it's just, it's just cool. It's a place I can spend ages. And not just because of the trains, like because of the view and all that stuff, yeah. For a line that doesn't have a great deal of trains, there's certainly a great deal of trains coming through. <laughs> Organised meet and greet, which I haven't done in over a year, which I think the last one was here. <laughs> um, yeah, it's. I do have a little community, but the rest of it's just a following. Yeah, we've had oh, a few here, which the most most successful one that I created was here, and about between fifty and sixty people attended. It was actually pretty cool. The train that I got, the train that I got off was um, the you know you get off from the rear door. It was the whole vestibule area and saloon was um, just packed of people just getting out. So I looked there, I looked here, there was already a few people here, and I'm like, okay, wow, I didn't expect this. Everyone sort of jumps and, well not jumps, but you know, um, they're like, Phil, look, this train's here. I'm like, oh yeah. <laughs> Some people just look at me and go, how can you sit at a station for hours on end? I can't stand waiting five minutes for a train, let alone stand there for six hours or something. I'm like, okay, I just have a lot of patience. <laughs> Others, um, and there's a few that I've encountered, really hate it. <laughs> really, really um, hate the whole train spotting thing, especially the whole vlogging side of it. Oh no, train spotting. Great, here we go. <laughs> I don't even know where this is coming from. Behind me by the sounds of it. Maybe. I oh, know it's not. Okay. No.
Cool. This is Wonder Bion. That sounds like something else. And this is all that happens here. V sets.